I be that young rapper dude Might just trap for you Coming with the thunder baby Might just trap for you I roll out in the morning light With that hearty bike All black, I'm the party type That looks on tonight I just stepped in no weapons But my outfit might take the souls In my presence impressive Got strippers slipping off the poles I just whip, then I swerve and wish you would I'm Timmy Turner, turn her to a carnivore Now she treat me like a burger Yo, what's up guys, Darkbreaker here, and for today's video, we are playing the newest skin of Volkev Shogun. I know for the Asian servers like Taiwan, Thailand, and Vietnam, they already got the skin, a few, I don't know, probably months ago, because Europe is always behind. We didn't even get the newest patch yet, so we are really behind, and it's for the Western regions, one the newest skin, so... Might as well to call it new skin, even though it's not really that new. So, we are actually playing solo lane Volkev. And we're using Sprint, because we decide we are going to troll this game. And we will just use Ultimate and Sprint and keep diving them, just for fun. And I'll show you the limits of Volkev. I think you already saw in the intro clip. You use Ultimate. You use sprint and then you just straight up run into the fountain. You have you need three stacks and then you have like 4.5 seconds uh, invincibility and you can easily tower dive, fountain dive even and you can survive. And walk of lane level 2 power spike extremely strong. The index play right now. Oh <laughs> and you're dead. That's what I mean. I didn't even need Execute. Usually I like to go Execute on Volkev just for the level 2 cheese. It works almost every time. You can, People don't expect the burst damage. You can try to trade and act like, oh, I'm so weak. You will get first blood against me. I'm so weak. I'm so weak. And then you just use S2, use S1, use Execute. And they, from 100 to 0, basically, that combo. You can see the damage. D uh, did you see the damage? I don't even have execute. If I have had execute right now, he would have died immediately. And yeah, I don't know what he was doing. Maybe checking shop, trying to backport checking shop beforehand or something. No idea, but uh, yeah, he's griefing. And that's the thing about Volkov so lane. It's either hit or miss. Either you do extremely well, you snowball like crazy. Or you're just getting destroyed and you can't do it much. So, in my opinion and in my experience, it's a hit and miss hero in the solo lane. You can go either 10-0 or you go like, I don't know, 1-5 or something. And it also depends on the matchup. There are a lot of matchups that are usually really hard for Volkev to win. Omen, you can't win that one. Yina. Past level 4 super hard. If you don't have ultimate, you can't really win it. And then she she just out sustains you for free. Um, Florentino depends. Depends on the player, honestly. If he misses his flower, and if he doesn't snowball you at the beginning, then you have a decent shot at winning at the early and mid game. But if he just straight up rushes Hercules or Mail of Pain, then yeah, you don't have any chance anymore. So honestly, oh. Ooh. Okay, nice ultimate by... Okay, that one was nice one. Nice one. Nice Zenia ultimate. Let's go. <laughs> He's actually writing, My team is so good, better go AFK. That's uh, was in Vietnamese sarcastic. Because we are uh, already stomping, he's like, okay, easy, easy game, I don't even need to play. That's basically what he wrote. Yeah, I don't have ultimate, so I have to be careful. We have Batman here. He's trying to gank, but Yina's playing really safe. She saw the Batman um, signals. 
that um, Batman is nearby, so she just decided, yeah, okay, let's hug the tower. We don't really want int anymore. At this point, you might think, oh, this game is going to be such a free stomp, <laughs> but you will see <laughs> we are trolling so hard that it's not going to be a free stomp. No, a little spoiler, but you can see at the game length, length that it's really long. 90 minutes, so the game is actually really long and it's not a free stomp. Because of place like this. Actually, I will survive this. Let's run! Run, run, run! Yeah. For Dira, for Volkhev, heroes like Dirac, Alice, they are just super hard for him to play. Just because of the CC chain. Dirac, CC chain, Alice, CC chain. You're trying in the ultimate form, you're just getting kited, so it's extremely hard for you to play Volkhev against heavy CC comps or for example against you know it's actually really hard as well if you get once if you don't have ultimate and she pops sell CC chain onto you it's just so hard to survive because she will one shot you pretty much and even if you have ultimate you might not even be able to activate your ultimate if you get CC chained completely Okay, uh, actually I didn't get it. L let me think about uh, something I will say when I'm diving. When I'm diving I will say something really funny. Just wait for it. Ooh. This is actually not, not uh, okay. We get the speed and now we keep going. And yep. Oh, I missed. I missed my S2, but she jumped out. I probably couldn't have killed her anyways, even if I hit it. I, will, I, will, I mean, look at my HP, I'm super low. Yeah, the, it's basically like Chi, the blue Chi skin. Just all Volkov skills in blue. It's, I mean, it's a good change, because always playing the same skin, it's kind of getting boring. You want to switch up, switch up your clothes as well, so switching the skin more var uh, variety, uh, not so boring anymore. The survive, and, the weak and for the build, we are actually going for full damage Warcraft build. Rank Breaker, Omni Arms, Fenrir, Hercules, and last item, we will actually go for Claves. You might as well go for Devsicle or Blade of Eternity, but I want to go for Claves just for the extra damage. And Claves actually great synergy. The moment you come out of your ultimate, you have five seconds invincibility, and during that time, you will do so much damage. And if you have crit on top of that, boy, that's so much damage. And right now, we just decide to dive because we are crazy and just want to have some fun and <laughs> make some awesome plays happen, except for this one. Just Diving between tier 3 and Nexus, and maybe not the best idea. Maybe not the best idea. Okay, 21 4. We are actually kind of inting, and he's giving shot on as well, so yep. No, no wonder this game is going to 20 minutes, basically, if we are just inting like this. But I mean, just having a little bit more fun. Enjoy Volkhev, Ultimate, Sprint. You just have to try it out. Try it out for yourself. Play the new skin. It's for free, actually, on the servers. You just have to log in during, uh, I think, 17 to 27, and then you can redeem it. So actually, really nice from... Tencent um, to give the skin for free but no new patch yet no Kirito yet no Kirito skin yet so yeah maybe give new patch first before you give me a new skin okay we didn't get laser or oh, actually Zenia is tanking for us but I thought I could backpot maybe okay goodbye goodbye I, I can't escape this how am I supposed to escape this <laughs> Nina. Nina's still at tier 3, so even if I try to escape from 
from the tier 3 Yina was waiting there and we just I just died anyways but yeah we don't have new season as well the season is going for four months now total four months it's just insane i just i just saw the other day you know how many stars you need for conqueror in europe you need 700 stars and the top one player has 2.2k stars and in europe there's no star boosting like i know in vietnam there was star boosting before but now there's not so it's and also the matchmaking is different so you will match much the queue time is much higher in thailand for example and the matchmaking is better so that the average matchmaking rating is the same overall so if you play you have role role priority first of all you can decide which role you want to play so the queue time is longer because of that one also the game will try to match you against even players for example if you have five players on average with 60 percent then you will play against five players with 60 percent on average for example if you play against conquerors you will play against conquerors and so on so the queue time are really long in thailand because of that reason so people have much less stars you can play trio queue or a uh, trio kong is not possible you can still play trio queue one conqueror and then two master players or one conqueror and veteran players that's what actually a lot of pro players do they just one person plays on their conqueror account and the other just plays on veteran account i mean i if you check out Liebang, for example he just spams um with two masters that are actually pro players as well so it doesn't even matter if they are not conqueror but yeah, I remember when I was in Thailand, I played solo queue. In the evening, Sunday evening, I waited 10 minutes in the queue. 10 minutes in the queue, sometimes. And actually, yeah, 10 minutes is just insane for evening. That's actually mind blowing. In Europe, evening, one second, pew, insta queue, easy, let's go. Ah, I wanted to say when I'm diving, they see me rolling, <laughs> they hating. It's Batman. Next time. Next time, some cringe moment. Okay, can I hit him? I miss. Nice one. Okay, nice done. Okay. I hit him. I will just jump in. One stack. Okay, let's just cancel immediately because I don't wanna. I don't wanna get bursted because you never know if you just get bursted quickly. If I jump into five people, of course you want to get the three stacks so that your ultimate invincibility lasts longer. But better not because we're full damage. Better cancel it quickly, and then we can still. Like the timing is really important with Volkev, how you use the ultimate. Because if you're ahead, then most of the times you can get the three stacks very easily against four people, against three people while diving in, because they can't burst you quick enough. But if you're behind, then you should always immediately cancel your ultimate, because otherwise you're just getting one-shotted and bursted without even being able to activate your ultimate again. A lot of times I see it, people are like 0-3 or 1-4 on Volcav, they are behind, so what do you do then you have to cancel your ultimate really quick when you're trying to initiate because otherwise you're just getting one-shotted and bursted out of your ultimate okay let's jump again <laughs> just yolo just fucking yolo one two stacks three st okay two stacks i hit him he dies and now let's maybe dash okay sprint no, Hina, don't do this to me. Why are you? Why are you doing this to me? Okay, actually, Hina's cleaning up. Not bad. Okay, Zaniel, Zaniel, Zaniel is killing Hina. Okay, almost. She she actually dashed backwards, but still survives. Okay. Okay, Tulan is using ultimate. Nice one. Maybe they can finish now. Okay, Hina is back.
weight. They can't finish. They don't have minions anymore. And the others are respawning, so we can't finish right now. And I still want to get Claves, because I want to show you how strong Claves is, actually. The moment you have invincible, uh, invincibility and just keep auto-attacking, auto-attacking non-stop, just so much damage. And now we're building Claves. Just getting blue buff. The others are fighting top side. So I will try to join this if they are not already winning. I feel like they are already winning so hard that I even if I come they Yeah, I can't really do much here. And like I said, Alice, D Rock, absolute annoying, super annoying. Can't really play against it as Volkov because whenever you try to engage you get CC chained. You see. He's just pushing me left and right, and I'm just taking so much damage for free. And let's see if I can hit her. Okay, I'm not even hitting her. Let's just dive. Yeah, just dive. Boom. Oh, I thought I still had ultimate. Feels bad, man. Are they finishing? Yeah, I think they are finishing this game now. Wait, the others are respawning. just asking me if I'm recording. Yes, I'm recording. Yes, I am. And think I still can't finish. Oh, God. Oh, Slims. Nice one. Oh, and there's Yina. Goodbye, Slims. Goodbye. <laughs> Maybe we can kill Yina. Actually, I, uh, I should have uh, speed up my deaths so that the game isn't too long because I'm just sitting death 40 seconds whenever I die. Totally forgot to do it. And now we're already commentating. Next time. I will remember to do it next time. Okay, Enraged Dragon is up as well. I'm just thinking, yeah, we should try to finish soon because they have such an annoying late game and I don't really want to keep playing late game. D Rock Alice, disgusting. Oh, I missed S1. Okay, horse is here. Let's go in. One, two, three stacks, and let's go in. <laughs> let's just dive because we can't. Boom, boom. And do we survive? We actually still survive. Let's go. And, and that's the game. We we just played Volkhev and just kept diving. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video of us playing Volkhev, new skin Shogun, trolling around, just diving non-stop. And if you guys enjoyed this gameplay, then of course, please leave a like, subscribe, and i see you next time. Bye-bye.